as a woman on TV, doing what has traditionally been a man's job, you know, I'm talking about what's going on in the financial world on national TV, on the BBC, and, you know, as a, as a northern woman with an accent doing that, there was a lot of shock when I first went on the TV of like, oh my goodness, you know, what's this woman doing on TV? I felt a real responsibility to do that job well and prove to lots of other women that they can do it. Um, because there are times when I first started where I thought, oh my God, I need to be like how other people have done this job. So, you know, I need to be like a BBC person and do all that and, and be quite macho. But actually my biggest strength is being normal. And that's my unique selling point. As mad as that sounds, being a normal person and being authentic has got me my success. And I think that's a really important message to send out to other women. I get lots of women coming up to me. It happened on the train on the uh, earlier on. And this lady said to me, oh, I love you because you're so normal. And it's like made me think that, you know, you don't need to be dead blokey, do you? Or you don't need to be whatever it is, bossy or hard on people in order to get where you want in life. And I'm like, yeah, that is key. If you learn nothing else from me, I don't care if you don't learn any economics from me, but if you look at me and think, oh, that's a woman who's just herself, perfect, then I've done my job. And I really definitely feel the weight of that. And, tell, and I say that to young people all the time. Whenever I talk to young girls about what they want to do when they're older, I would say, don't lose who you are. You've got a great personality. You know, you've got, you, you're clearly clever. Use your own skills and your own authenticity to go and achieve what you want. And don't let anyone tell you you can't either.